What's up guys, Cursive Man here doing this quick update video. I got a couple things in the mail the past few days and I wanted to show them off real quick plus some other things. Uh, my wife got a new Living Dead doll and I wanted to just show off uh, um, another one that a friend of hers made that's pretty creative and it kind of goes with the concert we're going to see next week. Going to see Marilyn Manson and Rob Zombie so I'm pretty excited about that. And uh, just wanted to um, also want to, before I get... Uh, started with all that my buddies Ben and uh, Gary um, well Ben tagged me and Gary uh, Mongo Stone Time 07 when I say Ben I'm talking about Mr. Fix and Smash tagged us in a video for our non key um, favorite comic book covers and uh, both those got he, he tagged two people Mr. Fix and Smash did of course it was me and Mongo Stone Time and uh, Mongo Stone Time tagged two people because you know we're we're outlaws, we're rule breakers, and uh, obviously I wasn't thinking very good because I didn't tag but one guy, and uh, I meant to tag two, so I'm now using my other hand that I didn't get to tag with, and I'm tagging uh, Gambit896. I want to see what your favorite non-key issue um, comic cover is that you have, man. I really enjoy your videos. They're freaking awesome. You're, the way you do reviews is great, man. I, I really enjoy it. Keep up the good work, and uh I'll put his link below so y'all need to check him out. He's a really nice dude. And um his reviews are just awesome. So make sure you subscribe to him. It's uh Gambit896, so y'all check him out. But uh anyways, um these are some of the packages I got in the mail. This is uh um <clears throat> a trade I did with uh King Joe. I had a bat Hot Wheels car that I was putting up for trade. I had like three of them and I did a few trades. And uh, he had some Vampirella issues that I wanted, so uh, he was nice enough to trade with me. So, I'll show you what I got. These are a couple that he threw in extra. So, uh, it's Vengeance of Vampirella issue number nine. I haven't read these yet. They're really awesome looking, though. I um, don't know who that cover artist is, but it's uh, from 94. Really cool looking cover there. And issue number seven of Vengeance of Vampirella. She almost has like a bodybuilder look to her right there. Um, I think the God when I was little, I used to watch these freaking workout shows. I don't know why, but probably because the chicks wearing bikinis or something. But I think the lady's name was like Corey Hart or something like that or something. She was this huge bodybuilding. I was just like obsessed with her, and it kind of reminds me of her in this picture. But uh, anyways, I'm probably probably wrong on that that name. But anyways, so yeah, there's that one. Uh, this is uh, the couple that I asked him for. This is uh, Vampirella Death and Destruction issue number one. And this is probably one of my favorite covers of Vampirella so far. This thing is just awesome. <laughs> you can tell why I like it. But anyways, that is great. Yeah, this classic Vampirella cover is amazing. And uh, issue number two, Vampirella Des Death and Destruction. Another very cool looking cover. And uh, issue number three of Vampirella versus Hemorrhage. Um, I flipped through this one and the art in this thing is amazing. And it's a really like, it's not, I mean, it's not, it's weird. It's not thick, but it's like the pages are made up of different kind of material. It's really hard. It's not the flimsy paper. And the art in this thing is so awesome. It's got a cool pull it out poster. I'll pull it out real quick to show you guys. But um, let's flip to that real quick. Sorry. Really awesome poster in there. I hate that it's stapled in here because I damn sure would be putting it up. But uh, anyways, so that's that one. And I appreciate that, uh, King Joe. That was awesome you trading with me, man. I really do appreciate that. And the extra stuff you threw in, man. Thank you. And uh, the other package I got in the mail was a um, book I ordered from Midtown, which took 25 years to get here, but it finally made it. And uh, it is Howard Chaikin's Black Kiss number three of six. And this is the book that my comic shop decided to quit selling the day it came out. So, yeah. He took all of these and threw them in the trash the day it came out. And emailed me that day and said, hey, I'm not selling this. It's something I won't sell in my shop. So, that's, <laughs> that's his choice. That's, you know, whatever. But, I mean, if he had it, I wish he would have just gave it to me. It would save me, save me shipping cost and whatever. But he didn't want to do it. And it's not, I'm not even going to pretend like it's a, a 
modest look because it's not and I'm not a modest person so it doesn't bother me but the uh, the stories are very graphic the, the art is very graphic but the stories are cool though they're really funny I mean they of course are super adult theme but you know it's, it's basically this is a uh, she's a demon I don't want to go too in depth because somebody might want to decide to start reading these. But she's a demon and she's basically like an incubus, which is like a, a sex demon, sort of. And um, she's going around killing people throughout different t periods of time. I mean, like one of the stories in this one was uh, in Paris while a Nazi occupied it during World War II. And uh, one of the other ones was uh, Revolution, Revolutionary War. I mean, it. It goes on back pretty far, so it's uh, and then it goes on into the 50s in here. So the same uh, evil um, uh, incubus or whatever the hell it is goes through killing people in sexual ways. Is basically what the story is about. So that's that. Um, but I don't want to drag this video on too long. Uh, just wanted to show these cool little living dead dolls my wife got. Um, her newest one. I think uh, Mongo Tom Tom Gary probably seen this one on Facebook. <coughs> Excuse me, but it is the the new Chucky that just came out from Living Dead Dolls. <coughs> I think this is from the Bride of Chucky movie. <coughs> I don't know why I'm getting all choked up here, but anyways, it's pretty pretty cool little dog. He's got his little shoes and all that. And his little <coughs> knife there. So yeah. And then this one, I'm going to see Rob Zombie and Marilyn Manson next week. And uh, this one was a, this is a living doll that my wife had personally made for her by a friend of hers on um, Facebook. And if any of you are interested, shoot me a message and I'll get you her contact info. But she made this thing from scratch. Uh, she took one of these living dead dolls completely like stripped it down to nothing these are hand painted by the way all of them are hand painted stripped it down to nothing and made my wife a Marilyn Manson living dead doll and this is from the video the nobodies if you can just google that video you'll see them and they're just like this she made the the outfit painted the you can kind of see the texture on his skin uh, she painted repainted his eyes added all this work to his head and everything mess with it too much because my wife would kill me if I did something to this but added all this stuff to his arms his hands so yeah that's uh, that is her Marilyn Manson custom one of a kind living dead doll she had made for herself so um, that is that that doll was actually at one time a Lucho Libre doll that's how much she had to take off of it. his face was painted up like a sugar skull and all that she stripped it down completely added the new paint texture and all that stuff so it's, I mean it's amazing what well, she's a porcelain artist so she's got some mad skills but uh that's it for my little quick update video I just want to keep this short and sweet it's going on nine minutes now so it's not too short but anyways uh like I said y'all give my man uh, gambit896 a, a, a friend request on here and uh, sub to his videos and watch them he's a really great guy and y'all check out my Facebook page, Comic Book Central. Just Google that, on, or not Google, but just look it up on Facebook, Comic Book Central. And uh, join us on there. We're talking about comic books, videos. Feel free to post your videos. Add me as a friend. I'm Tony Montgomery, so y'all look for me on there also. But uh, anyways, y'all take care, and I will see you Wednesday with my comic book haul.